Hello, everybody. Welcome to Sequest Refest 2023. This is my this is my panel debut. I am I am known to the fandom as the Creepy Kevin. I like creepy things, video games, burgers, and I don't know if you know this, Mario. No. Shocker. <laughs> All right. So, to those who are, how many of you are familiar with the game show Let's Make a Deal? Oh, quite a few of you. Good, good. Now, I hate to tell you, but there won't be any brand new car, or there won't be, you know, 10 grand. There might be some money on the line, however. So, here's how it usually works. Each round is completely random. You, can, you, might, you might either play a game, or I'll just simply have you make a choice each round. Now, depending how many people play, um, we, we, we first, um, if you win, you, if you win a prize, you might have an option to play another round for another prize. However, to those of you who saw it, we have a zonk. A zonk is when um, something we want to avoid. That's what when you get zonked, you either lose a round and possibly even the prizes you probably poss you probably previously won. And we don't want that, do we? Alrighty, so I'll either do some games like, like a cup shuffle, or just have you make a choice, or we even have one friendship game. Alrighty, so let's see some hands. Who wants to be in the first round? Alrighty, let's see. Who do we got? Um, you know what? This guy was acting cool the other time we were waiting. Um, the guy in the rainbow dash hat. You, you, yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, you, you come to the stage, yep. Yeah. Oh, thank you. So, here's where we're going to start. Would you like to choose a prize from one of these three boxes? Or, would you like a bag of chips? I'll take the one box, please. Okay. Do you want to check to see if there was anything in the bag? Yes. Okay. There's chips! <laughs> and also, there was a $20 bill. Oh. <laughs> <sighs> See? That's why it's called Let's Make a Deal. <laughs> some deals are good, some are not. Alrighty, so, choose a box, and I will gladly open it for you. And let's, and let me give you one little warning. One of these boxes have a zonk. So you have a 33% chance of getting zonked, a 67% chance, I don't know where that extra one comes from, just because I'm awesome. All right, pick a box. Okay. Let's hope we avoid the zonk. You remember what it all looks like, right? I put a picture of uh, whatever that villain's name is from Gen 5. I don't know that evil witch one. Oh. <laughs> uh, that's the zonk. Oh. <laughs> Next in line, please. <laughs> Alrighty. One second. I gotta do a little shuffle. Maybe trade boxes, or maybe no zonk. You never, never know. Again, shall we? Yes. Or should we? Hmm. Should I 
Did I put the dunk in here? Uh, just, just so you all know, if you win a prize, I need the box itself. The prize is yours. <laughs> With all due respect, I can't really you know, hide the prizes if you know I don't have anything to hide it in. You know what's not going to be a prize this round. Okay, next contestant, please. All right, how about you, the one in the purple shirt with the twilight and the flare shine? Now, we are going to play the same thing we played last round. Now, would you like one of these boxes or a bag of chips? You got it. You want to see what was in the bag? It was the Zonk! So we avoided that. That's good. All right. Pick a box and let's see what you've won. Or will you? The black one? League of Legends? You sure? Okay. You have won a League of Legends set. You won an Amoru Punko Pup, a Thrash Keychain. Oh, what's in here? Whatever this name is, a uh, Funko figure. And you won a League of Legends, uh, Funko Triplets, Project Paro, Paro, and Paro. Congratulations, you won our first prize for today. Alrighty. These are for you to enjoy. No problem, thank you for coming up. Alright, you know what? I'm done with these bag of chips. <laughs> Alrighty. What? Alrighty. Now, this is where the panel gets good. We're going to have a friendship game. I'll explain that. But first, I need two volunteers. Okay. Let's take uh, this one right here, and let's take, hmm, you know what, just because I like your hair. The one with the cyan blue hair, I think. Okay, so here's how the friendship game works. Do you two know each other? Okay. What are your names and pronouns? This is she, that, she, that. 
Mary Kay, she, her. All righty. So here's what we're going to do. I left my back down here. <laughs> this bag is not a prize, by the way. Okay, this will be a game of trust or takeaway. It depends how much you two trust each other. Here's the thing. You can either share it or keep away. And this is how we, we do this one. See these cards right here? On this piece of paper, we have Sunny and we have Izzy. Look, they're together. They're friends. Isn't that nice? This one, however, has Scout. Now, you two are going to go on each of the end of the table and make your selection. If you both choose the friendship ones, you both split the money 50-50. If one of you chooses Scout, the one who chooses Scout gets one, and the one who chose the other one gets nothing. However, if you both choose Scout, neither one of you wins. So this is a game of trust. Do you want all the money, or do you want to keep it all for yourself? Now, each of you go to the end of your table, shuffle your hands really good, and make your selection. When you come up, have your, have your card up against your chest, just select one, hold the other one down. You have hooks, so that might be a little trouble for you. All right, you right there, and you right there. Hey, 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 not yet, not yet. Gotta put it on there. No, 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 no. Gotta, gotta. Okay. Actually, make it even more juicy. Both of you turn around while you make your selections. Okay. Shuffle your hands and make your selection. Okay, now, put, hide the other one and put the one you've chosen against your chest. Or wherever. Just don't show it. Come on up. All righty. I'm going to start with you. Show me, then show the contestants on the count of three. One, two, three. You chose to share. Now, did you choose to share? Are you a good friend? Three, two, one. You share. Here you go, and here you go. Thank you very much. You know what? Let's see if we do that game one more time. Can I have two more participants, please? Alrighty. Alright. I will choose. Let's choose that guy in the corner. Yeah, you. Yeah, you look around. And let's see. How about the one with the Rainbow Dash black shirt? Yeah, you. No one's gonna die. <laughs> this isn't the Hunger Games. Although, maybe a good idea for Hunger Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm not that evil. I'm a little evil, but not too bad. All right. So, I already explained the rules last round. However, there's a little uh, down, but maybe good side. There are, there's no money this round, but these two prizes have, like, prizes and not a zonk. 
So, you know what to do. Both of you on the end of your, so you win, uh, you know, you choose to share, you share the boxes. You choose the stealing one, you steal both boxes. Both of you choose scout, you get nothing. All right, this is a game of friendship. Oh wait, what are your names and pronouns? Uh, Solis, uh, Matthew. All right, Solis and Matthew, good luck to you guys. Let's see if you guys are good friends. I don't know. All right, turn around. Shuffle your hands, make your selections. And just so you know, if you won a prize or if you got zonked, I'll, I'll let you guys play again, maybe because we don't have too, too many people today. All right, did both of you make your selection? Okay, I won, put the other one against you, whichever way you feel comfortable. Alrighty, did you both make your selections? Okay, both of you come on up. Alrighty, Mario's being evil today, isn't he? I do a lot in the seats. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna start with you. Which one did you select? You chose the share. That is good, that is good. Now question. Did you select the share? <laughs> okay. Three, two, one. You chose the share! <laughs> All right. All right. Now we're going to do another little mini game. And this one does not put anything on the line. Well, except first choice. Play a game of rock, paper, scissors. First one, whoever wins gets the first choice. And don't, don't worry, these, none of these are zones. So go ahead, rock, paper, scissors. All right, so you get first choice. Which box would you like? Only these two, this, this one's got nothing. There's no zone, I, I, I promise you. Red, okay, let's do what you want. You got a nice $20 bill, oh, how's that sound? All right. Oh, I'm not a grandparent. I'm not even a parent. <laughs> and you won. Oh, what do we got here? An Armor King Funko Pop from Tekken. Oh, there's something else in the box. You got, woo, Chung Lee Rock Candy Funko. Oh, the look here. Okay. Now, for the next round, let's see what I got of my evil bag of doom. All right, next round. There's no zone for choices. It's actually gonna be just a question. Your prize will be this rainbow dash plush from Alpha Academy. Sorry, wrestling fan. Rainbow Academy. All right, who wants to win this plush? All right, and I, I'll choose anyone even if you already played. Okay. Hmm. How about you? All right. All righty. What is your name? Uh, my name is James. Hi, James. How are you doing today? Uh, it doesn't matter how you're doing. <laughs> I'm all kidding. How are you doing? I'm doing quite well, thanks for asking. <laughs> so? I'm doing okay. And then I woke up. <laughs> okay. So, for this one, I need you all to be very, very quiet. Uh -huh. <laughs> now, I'm going to ask you a question. If you can answer it, you get this flush. All right. So. This one is going to be multiple choice. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna say the multiple choices first and then the question. Okay. Kathleen Barr, Kazumi Evans, Peter New, Tabitha St. Germain. Which one of those has never attended a Pony Con? Ooh, that's Oh, wait, 
I forgot to mention there's 60 seconds. Sorry, this is my first panel. I am so sorry. I probably should have waited. Yeah. Gives you time to think. Hey, hang on, Monday. Hang on. Okay, 60 seconds of the clock. Now, let me repeat the question just so we can have a fresh mind because I paused him. Okay, Kathleen Barr, Kazumi Evans, Peter New, Tabitha St. Germain. Which one of those have never attended a PonyCon? 60 seconds, starting now. Kathleen Barr, we can stop this cup talk talk now. I hate to tell you, man, but you're correct. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'm always doing another question. Alrighty, evil bag of prizes. What did we got? Evil bag, huh? These are not evil. We got come by some apples. Wait, wrong phone. <laughs> Applejack. Now, for this one, I want somebody who's been to BernieCon 2019. Oh, okay, okay. How about the one with the rainbow hair? Okay, when I start the question, I uh, start talking. Okay, this one will not be multiple choice because I think it's pretty well known of this incident. Okay, BronyCon 2019 closing ceremony. Not yet. <laughs> BronyCon 2019 closing ceremonies. Who claimed that Rainbow Dash is worth pony? <laughs> it was a Brony Cooper. He got beat up afterwards. Oh. No, say it. Don't say it. I still don't know. Take, 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 just take some guesses. It's Brony Cooper, people who are normally community guests. Actually, he went to a, he was a community guest recently at some pony cons. He has probably over a million view, uh, subscribers on, on YouTube. He hangs out with AC Race Best. You really don't know, do you? All right, well, we got, you got 20 seconds to take some guesses. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. First word. Mm-hmm. I, I don't know what that was supposed to be. Saber. And something that happens with electricity. Something when you go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Uh, it was saber spark. But, hey, don't worry. There'll be more chips to play. And plus, hey, come on. We know one thing about David Spark. He's a really wonderful guy. And the fact that he said Rainbow Dash is worth money, we know he didn't mean that. Because it's not true. Yeah. That title goes to Starlight Glimmer. Oh! Don't throw that to Taylor. Tell it right to his got it. All right. Hmm. I'm just glad they weren't here. They probably would have beat me up for that one. All righty. Now, what do you say I bring back the boxes? And you know something? I will do that next round. This round, however, we're gonna do another question so somebody can win this plush. All righty. Who wants to try to win the plush? All righty. Who hasn't played yet? Uh, how about the one in the green shirt? That's you. No, no. Oh, 
the jacket, sorry. Okay, yours will be multiple choice. I'll try to make it somewhat easy for you so you can win the plush. Maybe. It all depends on your acknowledgement of the show. Wrong video game character. <laughs> so that would be interesting. Alrighty, so I'm going to give you four multiple choice. And one of these people did not... Of making a, one of these celebrities did not make an appearance on the show. Okay, are you ready? Weird Al Yankovic, John Delancey, Robert England, or is it, is, what's that guy from Star Trek again? William the main guy? William yeah, William Shatner. So William Shatner, John Delancey, Robert England. What's that? Weird Al. Weird Al. Which one of those did not make an appearance on the show? 60 seconds, please. Well, I know for a fact Weird Al was on it. He played that one guy. Right. I can't remember the name, though. Keith Sandwich. Keith Sandwich, that's the name. Um, I'm just going to guess Robert England. Really? Are you really sure about that? I thought you knew your, your knowledge of the show. And you do. So you win this plush. Thank you for playing. I'll touch you. All right. Yeah, Robert England on the show, huh? That's the guy who played Fred. All righty. Do we have any more prizes in here? Oh, we do, we do, we do, we do. But first, I'm gonna hide them. Well, now I'll prepare for a work from our sponsor. Which is nobody, because nobody paid me. We're bringing back the boxes for this round. And you know what? Let's hide this song. Ow! I am the medic. <laughs> like it would fit in one of these things? Yes. Tell that to my ex. Oh. I probably should not have said that. <laughs> okay. Now, we're just going to do pick a box. All right. Who wants to win a prize? Me. All right. How about... Huh. Yeah, you know what? Hmm. Who has not? Put your hand down if you already played. This company only has three legs. What? 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 I'll let you guys wait your quarter back there. Come on, Dunn. Well, he's coming up at this point. <laughs> you know, I almost feel like I'm. I put the wrong game show for this panel. We're picking boxes. I should have called this deal or no deal. <laughs> you know what? That pin on your... Oh, okay, you know what? Let's, let's not talk about it. All right, man. What is your name? Uh, Shalor. Shalor. This is your first year at Sequestria Fest? 
Want to know what's up then? It is mine too. And my very first panel. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. One of these has a zonk. We don't want that zonk, do we? What he said. Anyway, choose a box. The blue one. That's the one you want. Okay. Oh, we want surprises! You won a Funko Pup Gears of War Swarm Sniper. A Gears of War JD Fenix Keychain. And an Atlas and Pilot, if I can get it out of the box. Funko. Now, what do you say we spice this up? I'll let you choose another box. But there is one thing. Well, you already know. There is a song. Do you want to choose another box? Or do you just want to walk away with prizes? Because if you get songs, you lose your prizes. I'll go for a box. You're going to go for a box? Yep. Okay, so you have a 50 50 shot here. Alrighty. Which box would you like? Alright, this is the one. Is this the zonk? That to be or not to be? That is not the question today. The question is, do you want the box? <laughs> You're gonna hate me. <laughs> but you won a prize. Yay. It's a really good one too. It's Pinkie Pie Good Show Job. Uh, and let's see, let's see what was in this third box. Well, actually, I already told you, didn't I? It was the zonk. So luckily, we avoided that, and you won all these fabulous prizes. Here we are. These are all yours. Here's the tail that fell off. Uh, I'm so sorry that fell off. It was fine when I put it in. Nothing? Well, to be fair, Pinkie Pie has to fight a lot of business. <laughs> Alrighty. So now... Alrighty. So, hmm. What game should we do next? Ooh. I know which game. It's gotta be done. One moment, please. your prize. Three cups. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Maybe. Am I the first panelist at this uh, convention to be down on his knees?
Any prayer guys want to play? You want to play? <laughs> hey, hey, this is Let's Make a Deal, not Family Feud. <laughs> All righty. Come on, Jack. All right, up. You know, you're a Pegasus, you can fly up here, you know. <laughs> But then again, the ceiling's too low. No, no. Okay. Got some spending money for you. The reason why I thought you were Herbert because you don't need to talk for this one. Now, here's a five dollar bill. We're gonna play the clutch game. I'm cocked and blitz. All right. Now, I think you already know how to play this, right? All right, follow the $5 bill. somewhat of a friendship game. Somewhat.
for this round, I need not one, not two, but three contestants. Three. All right. Hmm. Let's see. Is there anyone here I haven't chosen yet? Let's. Hmm. Hmm. I'll pick you. <clears throat> uh, let's try the one with the kitty cat mask. And let's see. I need a third. How about you in the green and red shirt? Oh, right. Oh, so. It's been a long day, okay? <laughs> yeah, you. Yeah, you. Now, do any of you celebrate Christmas or hard form, right? Yes. Okay, are you familiar with the game of the white elephant? Yes, slightly. That's where you pick a... I do it all the time. All right. So the name of this game is Can't Complain. You each choose one box, and you get what's in it. The next person gets to either keep the prize that the previous one won, and then, or choose a box. And the person who gets the prize stolen from them gets uh, to choose another one. So, alrighty. Let's choose one of these at random. I'm gonna improvise here, oh, wait a minute, I got my pen. You know what, I like your idea. I'm glad I chose it. I'm thinking of a number between one and ten. Seven. No. Eight. No. Three. No. Five. No. Nine. No. Two. So many numbers that no one's choosing them. One. No, you have them. already chose me. Oh, that's stupid. <laughs> They're not. Four. Yeah. Yay. Woo! Okay. Now, choose one of these boxes. Which one? The red box. All right. Here's why it's called. You have won a Twilight Sparkle plushie. All right. Now, number two. Second one. Think of number between one and five. Prize, or do you want to choose another one? You want the blue box. Oh, sorry. There's no reason to complain so far. Good. Let's hope this is not a zonk. You've got two plushies made by a fabulous crazy Carrie who has the same initials as me. You've got a red heart plush, and you've got the truck on exclusive crazy Carrie caramel plush. Okay, now I'm thinking of a number between one and one. <laughs> you know the answer? Yeah, one. Wow. Now, do you want to steal one of those plushies? Or do you want the last box? <laughs> Sensors. Did you make the choice? Uh, I'll take the box. Okay. You know, you also have the option to steal. I know. But let me tell you something. I'm a nice person. There could... Yes, you are. I can actually tell. But here's the thing. Before, I'll let you re... I'll, I'll tell you again. You can either steal or take the box because there is maybe, maybe, but maybe not possibly a zone. And that's why I want to be nice because this is, uh, this is a, uh, little, little. We're talking about friendship, right? Yeah! Yeah! yeah. 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 I will take the box. Okay. Finish. Let's hope it's not the zonk. Is it the zonk? Am I gonna trouble? Oh my goodness. Guess what? It's nothing! You got something. 
dogs. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was very nice of you. See, that's why I call Christmas magic. Hey, didn't complain. Alrighty. Are we at the ten minute mark? How much? One four. Alrighty. Let's see what prizes we got left, shall we? Why did the cup get in there? Yes, please. That should be nice. Okay. How many of you like Pokemon? Sorry, but like the saying goes, life isn't fair. I know it's mean, I'm sorry. But here's what we got. A nice Jigglypuff plushie that has lived on it for some reason. All right, this is going to be a question round. So that means, you guessed it, I'm going to ask a question. Who wants to win this uh, Jilly Puff plush? You know what? Let's choose you. Okay. You. <laughs> you know, and to spice things up, do you want it to be a Pokemon question or a My Little Pony question? Audience? Pokemon! Pokemon. <laughs> That's not an option. <laughs> Pokemon! Ellie Ray question. <laughs> okay, so uh, do you want Pokemon or My Little Pony? It sounds like Pokemon. 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 Pokemon ball, huh? Okay. For this Jigglypuff plush, I'm going to ask you a question of Pokemon in general. You ready? No. <laughs> well, too bad. Okay. And let's be mature here. Which one of these balls don't exist in the Pokemon game? Oh, oh. These balls. <laughs> Technically, you're right. Oh my god. All right. You listening? Yes. The neck ball. The master ball. The luxury ball, the mega ball, which one of those balls do not exist? Sure. The net ball, the master ball, the luxury ball, or the mega ball? The mega ball. You are correct! I do have some un bit of unfortunate news. I only have two, what? We're at the 10 minute mark. Okay. So, I only have two prizes left. All right. I need three contestants that like cookies. <laughs> you guys are like those birds flying eagle. Mine, 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 mine. Okay. Okay, so looks like you all already, wait, did I not choose any of you guys? Okay, I'll pick you. Who else hasn't played yet? Hmm. All right, I choose you. Yep, four. Or what? No, because I, because I don't want someone to get a walk away with empty handed here. Okay, who likes cookies? You know what? She convinced me. You. Now, before we start, there is no zonk. And here are the fabulous prizes. We got a Flufflepuff plushie. And we got, I don't know if I'm allowed to say his name, from Rick and Morty. Yeah. 
something like that. And those prizes are for you. And for this challenge, you're going to sit down. And this will be the last one for today. Well, they're not on stage. <laughs> All right. Now, you guys love cookies, right? Right. These ones are relatively fresh baked. Relatively. Relatively. I just got them from the bakery before this panel started. Now, I'm pretty sure you've seen this online game. You have to put the cookie on your forehead and get it into your mouth just by flexing your face. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. And then, first one to get the cookie in their mouth wins the prizes. But there is one bright side. If you lose, you can still have the cookie. <laughs> Consolation prize, right? Yeah. All right, so you gotta bend your head backwards, and then, oh shoot, I dropped that. Trust me, I actually did that at work. I tried to eat with the mask on, it was not hard. So put the cookie on your head, flex your face, can't touch it, and then, but if it goes below your mouth, you have to put it back on your forehead and start again. There is no time limit for this one. Well, 10 minutes. So that's why I'm doing this one now. Put the cookie on your forehead. No, you can't move your hands. Unless the cookie goes below your mouth. Yeah. Well, no, you have to flex the face like all right, it's broke, so I don't know if that counts. All right, on your mark, get set. Hey, how you guys doing? Not good. Okay, we only have too much time. Go. Oh, guy on the far left is already in the lead. Almost. Oh, oh! It was on the floor. All right, all right. You can also, you can move your head slightly, like left, right, or. I'm getting crumbs in my eyes. <laughs> You're welcome. Just, just, just put it back. might take a bit. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 Hey, consolation, you all can still have your cookie. We'll call that a sweet victory. So now you got a pink fluffy unicorn, but she's not on a rainbow. And you now got a little friend here. Say hello to your little friend. <laughs> All right. Thank you for it, my group. Thanks for that panel. And I hope to be back next year. Hope you all have a wonderful time and enjoy your prizes. Does anybody want to put their prizes in the box? I'm just going to discard them. Nobody? Okay. I'll, I'll recycle them. All right. Thank you, everybody. Enjoy the rest of your con. Now, I get a prize. I get to clean up this mess. <laughs>